before we get into the video, do not forget to like, comment and subscribe. Finally, 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 after a lengthy trial, a mom and her ex-partner have been jailed for the horrific injuries sustained to toddler Kyrell Matthews. Now, any parents out there should be utterly disgusted. 24-year-old Felicia Shirley, who worked with Children's Services for London Council, and her partner, 28-year-old Kemar Brown, who went by the name TG and at one point rolled with 6-7, the drill group, has been jailed for a combined 40 years, which is not enough. Two-year-old Kyrell Matthews did not have a chance at life. He did not know any form of happiness. He was non-verbal. He couldn't even communicate to the abuse he had suffered. The mum, Felicia Shirley, was too busy with her relationship that she blatantly ignored her own child's prolonged suffering, despite the fact that she was the one who recorded the evidence that ultimately got her and her partner found guilty. At the time of Kyrell's passing, he has sustained 41 rib fractures, internal bleeding from a 1.6 inch cut to the liver. He was twisted, punched, kicked and goodness knows what else. And the worst thing is, Felicia Shirley set up the trap to try and catch Kemar cheating. Instead, what she actually did was record the beatings, the severe punishments, and then she did absolutely nothing. Again, she did nothing. Let that sink in. She actively allowed her child to die. The fractures were caused by a twist in motion, as I said, and the fatal liver injury was from a kick, a punch, or a blow to the stomach that Old Bailey heard. Now, Kemar Brown was found guilty of murder, and that's the least. Shirley was acquitted of murder, but also convicted of manslaughter. The two disgusting human beings were sentenced yesterday, which was Friday, March 25th. Kemar Brown was jailed for life with a minimum term of 25 years, and Shirley, Felicia, was given 15-year jail sentence. Again, this is nowhere near enough. Two-year-old's child was deprived of a life. Stay safe. Safe.